initiative is offering an investment ready boot camp in an effort to address a critical funding gap facing uh, women entrepreneurs. Joining us now to talk more about uh, She Boot is co founder Julia Elvidge. Thanks so much, Julia, for joining us. Tell us what She Boot is. Uh, great to be here today. Thank you. Um, she Boot, as you said, is uh, a boot camp for women led businesses um, that are uh, tech and tech enabled and looking for their first external investment. And it's um, really revolutionary. I, I don't know of another um, boot camp that is really focused on uh, tech and tech enabled. Um, and what is amazing is it's led by women entrepreneurs and investors. So we're really trying to um, make sure that every one of the workshops is focused around you know, what will investors say, how to work with investors, you know, how to improve your pitch to, so you're really ready uh, uh, in front of those investors when you do. Um, we've uh, completed two cohorts, uh, and this is our third year. Um, 19 um, cohort members have, have gone through the program, and we're very happy to say that they have raised $8 million um, post uh, the program in either exits or uh, investment raises to date. Uh, and that's really uh, changing the landscape uh, for women today. Uh, begs the question, why is something that is sort of female-centric, female-led, female-focused um, of this nature needed? Well, um, last year, uh, women um, only received 2% of all the venture capital funding out uh, there in Canada. Um, and, and what's even worse is that's gone down. Um, uh, from you know 2.7 percent previously, so it's it's so critical. Um, and, and what we hear from venture capital, well, they say there isn't enough women founders coming to them. Well, that's what we're doing. We're making sure that women founders are are are, are getting past that first gate uh, of uh, in investment ready uh, for angels, so that they're ready to speak to the uh, VCs later on. And this is an initiative that's supported by Capital Angel Network and uh, Invest Ottawa, and it's critical uh, to its success uh, moving forward. Is the lack of uh, female entrepreneurs looking for capital, taking their pitches to the people who can fund them, is that the only thing that is you know, preventing women from being out there and, and investing and making that type of money and making that type of impact in the business world? I can imagine that um, that is not the, the only impediment. No. The, well, I think, um, I mean, one of the things that we're trying to change um, at, at the angel level, which is the earlier stage le um, of investment, is, is getting more women in the room when, when women mm. founders are pitching. Um, so uh, the second part of our mandate is to ensure that um, more women are getting involved. And we now have 20 uh, women investors as part of our pool that help uh, provide the prize money uh, for the program. And, and, and this year, we're um, very happy to, uh, to say that we're going national. Uh, so this is our first fully national year, um, and we're taking the program from 10 cohort members to 15. Fantastic. How can people get involved if this is something that uh, piques their interest, if they think they could benefit from something like this? Sheboot.ca. Um, all the information is there for applicants. And jump on it now. Uh, we'd love to, to get too many applications and, and have lots of work sorting through them. If you're not sure you're, uh, it really fits you, then there's email addresses on the website to help you um, and, and have conversations with individuals at Invest Ottawa. We look forward to reading your application. Okay. Wonderful. Julia Elvidge is the co-founder of Shibu. Thanks so much for joining us on CP24 this Sunday afternoon. Appreciate your time. Thank you. Bye-bye.